my little Ulta haul that took a couple weeks because you know mama's on a budget so I order things a little bit at a time but I saved it all for you okay <laughs> so Ulta I love Ulta but then I don't want to say I hate it because I don't hate it. I, I love Ulta. The only thing I prefer Sephora because Sephora gives you a bunch of stuff. Like Ulta, it depends on what they have. And when you order, like it seems like if they notice like you're the same order, they'll only give you one sample in one of those boxes. Now, Sephora will give you samples in each box that you purchase. Just a, a little note what I've noticed anyway I don't know if it's for everybody but for me that's what I've noticed but anyway let's get to this because I'm excited I haven't opened well I opened the box but I haven't opened any of the stuff yet except for one thing because after I looked at my um, receipt online or not online in my email I noticed I had gotten the wrong color I don't know how but I did but I'll show you that then I went to Ulta today and exchanged that so I might leave that for last. Give you some suspense. <laughs> I don't know why I make that noise either. Anyway, I'm going to reach in this box. And remember, I said I was on a budget, so I tend to get the smaller stuff. Which I don't mind, honestly. I know people would rather have um, the regular size stuff. But I tend to get like the miniature or um, the travel size stuff. And it seems to last pretty good. So, it works for me, it works for my budget, and it's not a big deal for me. But anyway, the first thing I pulled out is, this is a freebie, so I'm not going to mention that one yet. So the first thing I pulled out is this, it's in plastic still, so we're going to just tear that. This is the MAC. Prep and Prime Fix, whatever. <laughs> but anyway, I got the little mini. I didn't think it was going to be this small, but we'll see if I like it. It's a good way to, to find out if you like something instead of wasting such a big bottle. So I got this little travel size one, and I'm excited to try it. So I'm actually going to just try it now. Why not? Let me get this tape off, and I'd be right back. So that was a little tedious. Anyway, let's try this out. I guess we'll spray a little bit first, make it work. <laughs> oh, would help if I unlock it. Oh, I didn't like. Okay. Mmm, it smells good. Mmm. Okay. 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 I'm excited. So there's that. Let's just keep going here instead of playing. I tend to play a lot. Um, so the next little mini that I got, it is the Brow Vo Conditioning Primer. Brow, okay, Brow Vo, like Bravo. <laughs> so it's, this is the packaging that it came in. This is the packaging that it's in. This is cute. So what is this? This is, well, it's a conditioning. Hmm, fuller looking brows. So I guess it makes your brows fuller. It says brows instantly look fuller. Brows appear healthier looking. Okay. Conditions, so it's a nutrient-rich formula that contains keratin and soy protein known to help brows look thicker, healthier, and fuller. Primes, apply this clear gel. Okay, so this is a primer before you do your, your brows. I know you guys are probably like, really, where have you been? I've been under a rock, really. That's what happens when you have kids. You go under a rock. So my brows are done, so I don't really want to ruin this, but I guess it's just a, it's a little applicator. I don't know if you guys can see it. 
there's like a little dot in the middle and I guess that's where the product comes out and then you just prime your brows so I'll be trying that I might do a video on a lot of this stuff when I do like a little tutorial or something I'll try like most of the stuff so you guys can see it in action that would be fun for me anyway it's exciting all right the next thing I am pulling out is also wrapped in a little bag which is smaller than what I thought too but like I said I'd rather it be small than me waste stuff um, and this is the Redken iron shape 11 so this is a heat protector which I straighten my hair it doesn't look like it because you guys always see me with my hair up I think you've seen my hair curly once which is my natural hair um, but I straighten my hair a lot. It just, it looks prettier. So I don't smell anything. It smells okay. It's not strong, but it's not like exciting. But there's that. I got that so I can straighten my hair because I'm running out of the one that I already use. So I'm trying to find something better I guess because the one I've used I've used for years so the next product I pull out it's the real double the lip and this is a liner and lipstick in one lips look visibly fuller and sexier Ooh. said it instantly grabs and defines the lip line and it's an eight hour wear. Okay. And this is also, of course, the mini. This is cute. It's really, really tiny. I don't know if you guys can see it. It has a little bit of a shine, so. Oh, it just opens. Oh, that's cute. How do you, oh, the bottom. It's a little teardrop shape. And then it has the liner and then the lipstick in one. So I thought that was different. I thought that was neat to try. And you know, I love my lipsticks. So I'll definitely be trying that. And then my next peek is the Precisely My Brow Pencil, which everybody talks about this. And I've been wanting and wanting and wanting and wanting to try it, but haven't tried it yet so I figured why not they had a mini which is their mini this is a pretty good size mini I thought it, I thought this was gonna be smaller than this so this makes me really happy but it's the eye pencil let's see how much product is actually in this tube -y. oh wow that's disappointing <laughs> but anyway I'll try it I'll try it and this is supposed to be waterproof, so why not? So it's 24, no, not 24, 12 hour wear, waterproof. So it's an eye pencil or eyebrow pencil, which I've been attached to It Cosmetics eye pencil. So let's see if I can get away with it, with it, from it. Anyway, before I botch anything else up, let's go with the next one. So I got this Too Faced Melted Latex in the color Twilight Zone, which I think was like a lavender looking color, if I remember correctly. Yeah. So there's that. And this was on sale. So this is a full size, but it was on sale for like 10 bucks. So... I couldn't say no. There's, it's really pretty. I'm excited to try that, of course. And I'm excited that it's full size for half the price. Who wouldn't be excited for that? Next thing is, I did get another one of these. You guys already heard about this, but I, I got another little sample one 
I think it was so I could get free shipping or something like that. I figured I'd get something I use. Um, the next thing are two mascaras. Um, I've been seeing a lot of stuff on Instagram for these, so I figured I'll try them out. Why not? This is the NYX um, Worth the Hype Mascara, which I've seen a lot of people put these on Instagram. So... There's the applicator, which is pretty standard for most drugstore ones that I've seen. And this one, I think they only had one color. It was like very black or something. That's how, obviously what I got. And then the other one is the Total Temptations, which I've seen all over Instagram too and all over YouTube. So I figured I'd, I'd try that too. It's another drugstore mascara. It's my Maybelline. Yeah. Um, but I got mine. I've seen the regular one all over Instagram and YouTube. I got mine in the waterproof. Just because I figure I have a little um, better than sex one for the for uh, Zumba classes. So I figured I'd get a regular size um, waterproof mascara for my Zumba classes. And we'll see how this works. Let's see the applicator. And this is supposed to like make them really full. So it kind of looks like the other one, honestly. Should we compare? We'll compare. But like I said, this is like the standard for most drugstore ones. See, they kind of, they kind of look similar. Um, I've like used drugstore ones for so many years that to me that's what I always see in a drugstore mascara so those were that and then the last thing that's in this box is the Real Techniques sponge um, I have where is mine I have a regular I forget who made this one but it was from the drugstore I have this one and I do like it um, but I figured I, I need a backup, so why not try a name brand? Um, I will say the texture is different. Like this one is more, um, almost like a rubbery feeling. And then this one's more like a, a spongy type feeling. But I like the, the shape of this one because of this. Like I feel like it's a good way of like putting everything where it belongs. Um, and I know I say I hardly use sponges for foundation, but for some reason, I don't know if it's YouTube, I don't know what it is, but I've been using the sponge more to put my foundation and I've actually started to like it. So, yeah. <laughs> Let's put that back in the box for now. Um, so the next thing I'm going to show you are, I'm going to show you my freebies. One freebie I got that I was starting to mention, now I don't know what I did with it, is this 24 hour brow setter by Benefit, which I was excited because of the fact that I've been wanting to try their, uh, their eyebrow stuff. And this was like free if you got a certain amount of benefit products. And of course, this is their mini, like all the other stuff I have. That's their little applicator. It's like a, it looks like a little brush. Or not a brush, a comb. <laughs> yeah, it's like brushes on each side. But there's that. Ooh, it smells chemically. But right now, I've been using the It Cosmetics uh, Brow Gel, I think it's called. Something like that. I don't know. It's the It Cosmetics one. And that's what I use. And it's like a clear gel that I just put over top of um, my eyebrow. So, my other freebie is this uh, tote right here. Which I thought was pretty cool. Why not? So it says, sleep, slay, repeat. Tarte, double, duty, beauty. 
So that kind of tells you what I got. <laughs> so there's my little tote. Smells like a warehouse, like always. It's cute. I'm not a pink person, even though I have the shirt on. You know, it was a gift, so. But I'm not a big pink person, but I'd use that tote. I think that tote is cute. So after showing you the tote, of course, you know what I got. I caved. I'm sorry. I caved. And I got the Shape Tape Foundation. Um, I know there was that whole craziness all over YouTube. And it was, of course, very wrong of them to launch a certain amount um, and not include everybody. Um, but I did want to try it. I'm sorry. Don't hate me. Um... But what I did when I first ordered it, I was supposed to try medium sand. And for some reason, I ended up getting medium honey. I don't know how. But that was like really dark for me and very, very peachy. So I went and got matched, which according to them, I'm not a medium sand or a light sand. I am a light neutral so we'll see maybe I'll do a tutorial with this who knows see that looks light to me but I did notice when I swatched the other one which is still on my arm believe it or not look how dark that is um, it did oxidize even darker so hopefully this one maybe oxidizes I mean it's always better um, lighter than dark Um, just because you can bronze up a lighter than you can a darker. Mm. I think it looks good. It looks good with my neck. I mean, on camera anyway. But I, like I said, I'll do a tutorial with that and we'll see. I will get to these tutorials. I know you guys are like... You keep promising these and where are they? I will, I will. I got my desk, so they're coming. I promise, I promise. So, I think it's, it's a pretty good match. Yeah. We'll see, we'll see. And then I replaced my other shape tape because the other one I have is more like a skin tone, which I was just like bearing with it just to use it. So I figured I'm getting the new foundation. Why not get my actual, uh, the actual shade that I want, I should say. So there's that, which is, I guess I should tell you the shade, light sand. So those are the things. And then the little samples, which like I said, I'm always disappointed because they don't really give you a lot. But hey. better for Sephora right I love Sephora anyway I got the Becca coverage without the cake foundation full coverage breathable cream the secret to natural looking full coverage in the perfect blend of water and pigment 24 hour wear oil free 22% water creates natural finish and then they have 20 shades Fair to deepest tones. So I have here porcelain, driftwood, and maple. I guess I would be driftwood because I'm definitely not porcelain. And I'm definitely not maple, obviously. So maybe I'll try. I don't feel like there's enough in there. That's too small. Wow. Wow, Alta. Really? Wow. So I probably won't be able to do this one on camera for you guys because there's not enough for my face in there. Sorry. But there's that. And then I always love perfumes. So they actually sent me a fragrance, which I'll take it. And this is actually a Tarte brand. This, uh, this is called Sweet Tarte. That's pretty cool. So, ooh, sprayed a lot. And that was only one squirt. Mm. It smells it smells like candy, really. It smells okay. 
just okay. But anyway, there is my, um, my little Ulta haul. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys subscribe because there's more to come, I promise. Um, and I'll see you the next time. I love you all.